You know, John, this week we once again mark the anniversary of the 9-11 uh, uh, tragedy that uh, we yeah. had, and uh, it's a pretty somber time. Yeah, it, it's, uh, it was a terrible, terrible event in history, and it, it happened to us because I think we we ignored the evil in the world. That's that's my personal opinion. And I, I got to tell you, Art, um, I, I know they, a lot of people talked about 9-11 on Monday, but I don't think enough people talked about it. And I don't think it was covered enough on the news. And I, I think people in the United States have lost, we've lost a certain feeling of unity hmm. that brought us together when we realized these terrorists were attacking all of us. Um, and I, uh, we have, my opinion is that the country has fallen into a, a them and us mode. Uh, we're fighting each other instead of fighting the bad guys. So I feel very sad at that, but I'm also very sad at the loss of life at 9-11 and uh, hope, hopefully we can get back on it, on the track of unity. That's my opinion. Well, I have I have a, a whole number of thoughts on this, but my uh, one of my primary thoughts every year at this time is, uh, and you know that I have uh, I served in the military, and right. uh, believe in uh, never leaving anybody behind. And yeah. uh, the thing that uh, most concerns me about something we've lost is, uh, and the fight that people uh, are constantly involved in of all the responders who went to. Uh, uh, try to save people and dig people out over months and months yeah. and months and came up with all sorts of uh, uh, lifelong ailments and many of them died and they still have to fight to get uh, uh, coverage to take yes. care yeah. so there was a whole big thing for a period of time a couple of years out and then they sort of got abandoned and yeah. uh, so in a lot of ways um uh, that probably bothers me as much as anything else. Uh, and uh, to your point, uh, I think one of the problems we have today, and I know that we'll get past it because we got past it in major uh, uh, activities, uh, uh, even centuries ago in our own uh, history, is that unfortunately we don't have a common enemy that's from outside. We've made one another a common yeah. enemy. Yeah. And how do we go overcome that uh, beyond the purpose of today? But that's just my thought, is that yeah. we somehow have to figure out how not to make one another the common enemy. I agree entirely. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.